coming from a Green Country veterinarian. A dog is now being quarantined after a run-in with a rabid animal in Ulaga. News on 6 reporter Chris Wright has the story. The owner of Tyson, a three-year-old boxer, brought him into Will Rogers Animal Hospital after a run-in with a skunk. Testing confirmed that the skunk was rabid and Tyson hadn't been properly protected. In this situation, the poor guy was told that the dog was vaccinated and when they checked, it hadn't been. Now, unfortunately, the boxer has to be quarantined now for six months and receive a series of three rabies vaccinations like this one over a period of eight weeks. So far, the good news is Dr. Wallace here, no symptoms of rabies thus far. Since it's been three weeks now, he's not showing any symptoms, so I think he'll probably be fine. Dr. Wallace hopes this incident serves as a reminder to pet owners. Spring is when rabies risk is highest, and he says you should not put off getting your animal vaccinated. Rabies, uh, mainly in skunks, because they have adapted that they can live with the virus, and that makes it the, the bad problem. So if you see a skunk, usually out in the daytime, most of the time it's going to be rabid. While Tyson has made it through the tough part, he still has a long time left in quarantine, and even if he doesn't have rabies, that's five more months his owner will have to be without his best friend. But hopefully, you know, I think everything will turn out okay. Oh, poor